Hi everyone, welcome to our online teaching video of MS Cafe channel. Hi everyone, I hope you all are good. Today we are going to learn the from 4 chapter 5 subtopic of solving in this equation with addition and subtraction. When you see indices that involve subtraction or addition, the way how you do this question is to by letting y equal to something. So in this case, the first question we are doing solve 4 to 4 to the power of 2x minus 3 equal to 4 to the power of 2x minus 1. As you can see from this part, you can actually separate it into 2, which is 4 to the power of 2x times 4 to the power of negative 1. And in this case, you can see that in 4 to the power of 2x, there are a lot, appear a lot of time in this equation. So what we do is to let 4 to the power of 2x equal to y, change all the 4 to the power of 2x into y, minus 3 equal to y times 4 negative 1 will be 1 over 4 to the power of 1 here. And in this case, you will have y minus 3 equal to 1 over 4y. So how should I find y? Bring all the y to one side and the number to the other side. So this is how I bring. I bring the 3 to the right side and the y to the left side. So y minus 1 over 4y will give you 3 over 4y equal to 3. y equal to 3 times 4 over 3. y will be equal to 4. So y is y. y is your 4 to the power of 2x. And in this case, you know, 4 is to the power of 1. As in these two indices, they have the same base. So you can use the power to compare. And at the end of the result, you will get the answer for the x is 1 over 2. Let's try another question. <coughs> I have 7 to the power of 2x plus 7 equal to 8 to the power. To times 7 to the power of x. And in this case, I can't see anything that is related. Like in question 1, I can see that 4 to the power of 2x are appeared a lot of time. But in this case, I can see 7 to the power of 2x, 7 to the power of x. In this case, make the lowest power of 7, which is x. I mean, instead of taking 7 to x, take the one which is without uh, any number here, which is 7x. And Make 7x equal to something. So letting 7x equal to y. So in this case, you know that 7 2x will be y squared. And from this equation, you can say that y squared plus 7 equal to 8y. And in this case, bring everything to one side, you will have this equal to 0. Factorize this equation, you have y y, 7, and 1. So both sides put negative. You know that y equal to 7, y will be equal to 1. And y is your y, y is your 7 to the power of x. So in this case, this is 7 to the power of 1. 7 to the power of x equal to 1. As you can see in the same base, you can compare using the power. So x will be equal to 1. And in this case, 7 to the power of x equal to 1. So 7 to the power of x is equal to 7 to the power of 0. Anything power of 0 will be equal to 1. So in this case, same base, I can compare using the power. It will be x equal to 0. So that's all for today. Thank you for watching our video. Stay tuned for more video. If you are interested to learn online, we are now doing pre-order on online course with a promo price as we are doing we pre-order. So comment on below or find us at Facebook page at Cafe. Thank you.